Hi everybody, it's Lisa, Transcendence Brown, and it's been a while since I did one of these videos. And we're in the middle of packing and moving, so please excuse the mess, but nobody cares. So, I wanted to um, put up a video to say hi to everyone. Um, it's been a, a very intense time energetically uh, for many. Um, working on their own ascension process here, um, activating the light frequencies inside um, as we um, go through whatever phase of ascension uh, that each is in. And the biggest thing that is being challenged is everybody's belief system, as we have known, that um, is uh, the one thing that keeps us uh, anchored in old realities. And so, letting go of every belief system is necessary uh, on this journey here, and we don't even understand uh, what beliefs we have. Um, it wasn't fully until I had um, ascended the human uh, 4D, I call it 4D, whatever you want to call it, doesn't matter, um, aspect um, to come to walk on a new earth in the physical and was able to come from a place of unity consciousness um, inside, which is just, um, as some use as Christ consciousness, um, the unified field, we walk in it here. Um, it is no separation anymore. Um, Multidimensional, um, in the physical, and you know, walking as beings, um, being able to see multiple uh, realities, multiple parallels, um, multiple everything um, when we contract um, when the veils um, are put back in place um, we lose the ability uh, to be able to be so expanded um, now the cool thing is there comes a point when we're always expanded uh, here uh, that we might not be able to see in a million gazillion dimensions like we uh, have become accustomed to, uh, but we are no longer veiled, and that, that has been uh, an amazing experience recently, is to be able to actually physically exist, to be on the veils, um, to walk on New Earth at all times, to be able to tell the difference uh, between the different dimensional realms and then interdimensionality uh, lately. Um, where um, things become visible and invisible, um, there is a lot coming forth for many, um, embracing our own mastery and, and standing in a space of love and light and emanating this out uh, from within, um, no longer compromising our realities for anything out there. Uh, there is a power that comes from within us that is always there it doesn't go anymore um, we don't lose that connection inside a source anymore um, it might be weaker at times while we're integrating new frequencies within um, then it comes right back and then we are even brighter and more powerful and more we emanate more than we did before um, the, the uh, light activations that are occurring are bringing forth so very much um, all of our bodies have to unify as a one our vessel, our suit um, blows up with the air pushes out density um, there is so very much that occurs, the light body uh, the Merkaba for those who are uh, working to physically ascend um, there are a lot of questions by many and this is why we do what we do as uh, ascension guides, as new earth guides, as multi-dimensional uh, beings that walk here. Uh, we share our experiences to assist those who are ready. Um, not, our, not all uh, are yet, uh, but more and more uh, this is becoming uh, the normal for the world I uh, live in. Uh, we can walk between the different dimensions. We anchor new realities here. Uh, they change and materialize in response to us. Um, so every day is one of new 
Every moment is one of new. Everything that transpires is what we created, and we don't forget this anymore. Um, there's absolutely nothing that exists out there that isn't something that we created. The difference is, as a human, uh, we have realities that we don't understand. Here, uh, we understand everything, and we create from the inside out, and then it materializes for us and becomes a physical reality. Everybody has this ability, uh, and it's coming for so very many that have been working on this for a while. So, uh, for those that we have been in interacting with um, these last many uh, don't separate time, whatever, uh, you know who you are. It has been an absolute honor, and for those who um, we are interacting with now and who are coming, um, that is too. Um, for now, I just want to say hi. I just want to send out some love. I just want to share with you the magnificence um, that New Earth brings when you let go of the old, um, when you make a choice um, when you decide not to struggle anymore. Um, so many lately uh, refusing to make a choice or don't realize that they are making a choice and that they're struggling uh, immensely. Um, we don't have to do this anymore, but we do have to step up. We do have to make a choice and we do have to um, make it the most important thing there is. And when we do, um, we are honored in a multitude of ways and what comes forth for us is absolutely uh, brilliant and uh, beyond anything we could perceive so let it all go truly um, in every moment let it go and embrace what's within your heart and expand that from the inside out and look for magic look for what's different and expect the new in every moment um inspiration and desire from the heart and belief those three create new um, so embrace it and I'll be back to talk to you about something as soon as I can Mahalo and have a magnificent day